Hello and welcome back to Bit of Age. And today we're going to play My Memory of Us, Part Five: The Ending. Yeah, we're gonna wrap this one up. We're gonna find out what happens to poor Charles and Bonnie here, and and really, really see what kind of horror we're dealing with. Oh, what well, we got a okay. Wait, did that open it? Okay, I see. Alright, simple puzzles. Nothing to be concerned with. Just stuff we can do very easily. Without thinking. Without looking. Without... I don't know what I'm talking about. But I'm really excited to see what kind of ending we're going to get in this very grim story. Oh, is that live footage? Or is that fake footage? That's what I want to know. Is that it? Oh, we are on the wrench. Okay. We got the wrench. What do we need the wrench for? We need batteries? I don't understand what you kids are speaking. You're speaking a language I don't necessarily know. Something back here? Oh, we need to steal the batteries from the old one. There's two there. Are we, are we getting both? Or are we just getting one? We're just getting one. Okay. Here you go. Two batteries. Now we should have enough power to do things. Oh, there we go. The TV's still working. I thought I took power from the TV. I don't know why it's still working. Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're just floating around, suspecting that they'd be like flying red people, right? Because we have the ability to fly. That's why you're patrolling the sky. You know, them dirty flying red people. That sounds a lot more racist than I thought it was going to, but that that's the game. That's, yeah, uh, I don't know. Oh, oh, okay. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What's this going to do? Oh, I see. I see. And we're home free. Bye-bye, robot people. All right. Oh. Oh, you're just, just looking for flying red people. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, wait. You found the flying red people. Good for you. Uh, I never believed it, but uh, you were right all along. You're totally, totally justified for looking for flying red people. Uh, okay, here we go. This might not work for very far. Oh, okay, we're just, yeah, just do that real quick. There you go, kiddos. You are very good. Okay. Grab the hand and move forward. We do not want to be caught. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh. You saw nothing. There was no but no children here. Oh, Charles, you still have that. Light? Oh. I'll just go this way. Right, let's just let's just go this way. Oh, oh. Oh. Yeah, just go right back to sleep there, buddy. Robots that sleep! I don't know about you, but there was something don't seem right here. Oh, this is a bad place to be. What are you dreaming? Are oh, you dreaming of your female robot? How lovely! Oh, it's gonna take just one robot to not be asleep. Oh, there's okay. All right. Well, we're we're out of that mess. Oh no. What's gonna happen to the people? Hello? Hi, sir. What's up? What, what do you want? You want me to give you a, a given. A... Oh, your sweetheart. You want me to mail a letter to your sweetheart? Okay. I cannot guarantee anything, but we'll do our best. Is it key? This is gonna get very grim very soon. Oh, gee. Okay. Alright, don't worry, people. Oh, is this, is this the missus? Is this the letter? 
To the missus? Here you go. Oh! You're both in it together, sort of. I, I, I'm gl what? What do you want, old man? What? Do I look like a message delivery service? What? What is it? Can I get the key from the robot? Oh! You just ask children to get some keys to save your sorry butt from the predicament that you probably ended up in all on your own. No, not really. I, I'll, I'll do my best. Don't worry, mister. I'll, I'll save you. I'll save all of you. Us children. We got this down. Adults, they don't know how to do things right. Children, though, they got all the superpowers. Haven't you watched movies and media? It's always the teenager and the kids that are able to save the day. They know how to save the day. All the adults, they're completely incompetent. They don't know what they're doing. They just, you know, cause problems, which isn't too far from the truth. Uh oh. Mr. Robot. Great if you turned around. Oh. That, that was short lived. Obviously, we needed to cause a distraction. So let's do that. Alright. Getting there. Bonnie, you're up. What can you do? No red people past this point. Okay. What the heck is this contraption? We're gonna just start pulling le- Oh! We're fine! Perfectly fine. Nothing's wrong. We're just, uh, you know, messing with things. And none of the robots seem to- seem to mind. I- I- Boppy boop boppy de boop 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 Is that work? Is it- is that working? No? I wanna go back in here. Bonnie, can you just uh, put them back where they were? I hope, I hope that, I hope this is doing something. There we go. That's what we're supposed to do. Put the lever back up. Oh, I see. I take the key. I maybe drop the key. I don't know. I figured it out. All right, let's go, Bonnie. We got the key. We can save all the people, and now all the robots are gonna go, what happened to our people? And they're gonna be like them damn rotten dirty kids. I would have gotten away with it if it were This is a Scooby-Doo moment is what this is. All right, you ready, old man? We got your key. Are you ready? Are you ready to be released to the wild? Are you ready to, to, to discover the taste of freedom? Bunny does not have the key. Charles, you can do the dirty deed. All right. Bye-bye, people. Have fun. They seem awfully, awfully certain that is not leading them to death. Because dropping out of the air like that does not seem like a great, great plan. Especially if you don't know how the contraptions work. For all I know, they just plummeted to their death. Uh, which makes these kids really, really, really not too great. Yeah, uh, uh, we'll assume that everyone's fine. No, uh, I think that's that's the better better thing to do. Oh, is this our own little contraption to escape? We are now. There's no flying red people here. Who are you looking at? We were hopeful <laughs> and brave. We didn't give in. Soon we were eluding the guards on their flying platforms and making our way to the steam engine. We were too nimble and quick-witted for the clunky guards. Duh. Our minds were set upon carrying out our mission. Our mission of sabotage, rescue, and escape. See? Like I said, you don't need adults to solve your problems. Only kids can solve problems. That's how these things work. Didn't you know? Hmm. What do we have here? A bit of guns and weaponry? Ugh. No child should ever use a gun. No, that's a terrible idea. Oh. 
I went up. All right, Charles, you're up. Best of luck. You know, it would have really sucked if that led to squishing Charles. That would have been really bad. Really, really bad. I would have, oh, we need Bonnie. We need more weight in order to launch this lovely thing. Okay. What the heck is this? Oh, it's a laser. Alright. Let's go get Bonnie. Bonnie. What is the point of this contraption? Why do we have this on the ship? Is this like a mining laser? Why why are we mining ore and top on, on our own ship up in the sky? Wouldn't this make more sense down in, in uh some kind of you know mine? All right, we're loading it in. And that's the last piece. All right. Let's just shove this thing all the way back. Wow, Bonnie, you're really strong. Look at you, moving all that heavy load. It's so heavy that this machine... Whoa. Oh, that's... That's cool. Okay. You want the food? Is this is this your food? Is that is that what this is? Okay, here you go. Here here. No, you don't you don't you don't you're you're Okay. I don't know what we're doing. Oh What is this? Oh You have some poor circulation here, my friend. Um let me fix that for you. You can't eat rocks without good circulation and whoever maintained this robot was not very good at their job because he's really got poor circulation he don't know whoops my bad sorry I'll, i'm fixing it here you go look at that you can now open your mouth oh you're, see you know I'm, I'm just a friendly neighborhood child helping you eat your food there you go enjoy it's a it's an explosive delight yeah. Yeah. I, I said it was an explosive delight. My bad. I didn't mean literal. Oh, I did mean literally. We clung to each other desperately as the engine went haywire, and then, kaboom! Ooh. It exploded, and hot shards of metal flew everywhere. There were enough escape pods for the others. We helped them parachute down to Earth, but there were no pods left for us. Soon we were falling, screaming, towards the ground. When the kids are more noble than the adults and sacrifice themselves for the greater good. Okay. I have a feeling they survived. Yeah, look at that. The robot whale saved them. Thank you, robot whale. I'm sorry you're, you're broken. But I appreciate you keeping us safe in your your mouth, even though we blew up your uh, your friend. He had a good last meal though, and you know there's such poor circulation in that guy. We were doing him a favor. Where is the red people? I don't know, but kill them when you see them. Okay, Roger, Roger. And that's about the extent of that conversation. Oh, hey, people, did you not see the robots? Like, no, not even five minutes ago. Pretty sure we should be, uh, getting out of here as early as possible. Oh, oh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they, they got the right idea. You guys can do it. No, dude! Don't stop! Well, things are real now. They ain't getting us alive. They're they're just insta deathing us. They're insta killing us with their insta rays of insta dooms. Oh, I hear, I see the red beam. I oh oh okay. I'm just gonna just gonna sneak past. Oh no, oh, no the children! That's a crappy ending. I don't want that for the kids. They deserve life. They deserve. 
to have a happy ending of some kind. There's a treehouse here. Have you seen any red people? I don't even know what you're talking about, sir. Just make sure to kill the red people. Oh. <laughs> All right, man, turn around. Have your casual conversation with your casual person. There we go. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're, good. We're safe. We're safe. Oh. 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 Wait. There we go. Well, you know, you said what the, you know what he said about the robot deciding to do, do, you know, just kill all red people, right? So what happens when you're red? Let's find out. Oh my goodness! Look, a red person. Get him! That actually worked. Well, that's that was good. Eh, excellent. Well, look at that! You know, at least they're thorough and, uh, not discriminatory at all. They're willing to murder their own when they're covered in red juice. Oh, hi. Hello. I'm just gonna make my way this way. Whoop, 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 whoop. What about you, dear sir? You're doing a whole flippy flop switch swap. Okay. I'm gonna just stand right here in the center. I'm gonna book it. No! All right, here we go. We're free. Run! I hope there's a happy ending in store for us. Oh, look. Oh, it's the robot killing factory. What should we do about that? I think we should probably end it. Oh, that's their path? Let's do that. Alright, let's see. What's this thing? Got a key. Go up, go up, go up! Whoa, that was close. I feel like I probably should have left someone at the other end there. Just a feeling. Okay, Charles. I know, it's a scary thing. But you gotta go back, man. Oh no. This did not work like I thought it would. I think I, I kind of made it worse. Yeah, I definitely made it worse. Um. Oh no, Charles. Look at what you've done. <laughs> Look at what you've done, Charles. This is your fault. It's not my fault. I am innocent. <laughs> I did. Oh. <laughs> How much? Of... <laughs> I think I boned myself. Okay, uh, there's only one, one decision to make here. Yeah, only one choice. Here we go. Yeah, I'm sorry, Charles. It's not my fault. <laughs> it was your fault. <laughs> All right, lesson learned. Leave someone at the control station. Uh. That. That's what we want. No, Bonnie. My bad. Our we go. Say it. Uh, wait a minute. There's a pipe here. Don't tell me it was Charles that was supposed to go up here. Why can't Bonnie fit in the pipes? What, is she a big boned girl or something? Or what's this gonna do? It opens the door. There we go. Alright, we're good. We're good. After several deaths later, we're perfectly fine, and we're two alive little children. You did not experience fatality several times over because I was really bad at making decisions. No, that didn't happen. That was just your imagination. And now we're gonna do the whole, oh, okay. Awesome! It's our getaway vehicle. That was conveniently laid here just for us. Oh. Yeah, go Charles! I'm just gonna drink my coffee while you drive, okay? It's fine. Yeah, look at you go. You know what you're doing. You don't need me steering for you. Yeah, look at you go, kiddo. So pro. Oh. 
Oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, wait. How do I fire? I don't know how to fire. I didn't bring the thing. I didn't know I had fire. <laughs> I will make sure to actually read this time and not assume that my natural reflexes are good enough because obviously they're not. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna do this. What? Oh, oops. All right, here we go. What's the instructions? X, aim using space. Oh, space to shoot. Okay. Oh we go. Yeah, that's it. Shark on my whatever this thing is. Arrow gun. I am Van Helsing. Whoa, get out of here. Now, I do not want what you were selling me. You can go back to the hell you once came from. Please go back home. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh, that was close. That was so close. All right, I think we're, ah! I don't know what happened there. But, oh, whoa, 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 go up, down. Up, up, down, up. Okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Oh no, here we go again. Okay, all right, here's round two. I know you're determined. But uh, I, I don't really, I don't really want anything you're trying to do. I'm perfectly content. Way over here. You guys, you can stay over there. We'll stay over here. And this is where our borders will be, eh? You know, you know, you could, you could be the land of flying killer robots. And we'll be the land of two kids on a motorbike. And everything will be hunky-dory. And we don't need to interact with one another ever again. Aha! Oh no. Wait. Oh, slow motion to- oh! Whoa. No, I missed it! No! Alright. I'm not gonna screw this up. No, I, I missed! Third time's the charm. Come on. Alright. I got this. I got this. Just aim a little bit lower. No! Bonnie, your aim is terrible. I don't know why you keep missing. It's very fortunate that you have all these lives, though. Oh, crap. Ah, I got it! Ha! Hey, wait! A robot got through! We'd actually got out alive. We were somewhere deep in the countryside. There was a homely-looking cottage. The old couple who lived there were both wearing black and white. Our red clothes stood out a mile, and we worried they'd turn us in. But they brought us indoors. They showed us to their attic and gave us a meal. But we couldn't help thinking about her grandpa at home. He wasn't safe and warm at that moment. The next day, the old couple were concerned as they waved us off. We were returning to the city for her grandpa, facing almost certain death. I would say, because, you know, your grandpa is probably not alive, but I said this once before in a previous episode, and it turned out he was perfectly fine. So, hey, you know, let's, uh, let's be optimistic in times of war. Let's assume everything's hunky-dory. And go rescue your grandpa. I'm down. It wouldn't have been so bad, but Charles decided he had to paint himself red. Go, go. Oh, no! Charles! What'd you do that for? Charles! Ah, uh, Charles. You. You silly goose, you. Run as fast as you can. Okay, you're able to do it. That's a good thing. Oh, what's that, robot? You're thinking about death? That's great. Oh, okay. I'm gonna go this way. Hi, floating robot in the sky. There we go. There we go. I got it. I got it. We're fine. Well, that's convenient. This entire city. That was a perfectly good piano! Oh, we got a lady in there. Can I have my bear? It's in my bear, guys. Yeah, sure, we'll get you your bear. Considering you don't really have much hope and all the red people are getting taken out. Well, dude, I don't know. 
This is... Oh, well, look at all the... Oh, all their belongings! Oh man, why you gotta have a baby cry? See, is when you have babies crying, that's when I, I start drawing the lines. Um... She wanted her stuffy, but I don't see her stuffy in here. Uh, the sounds. No, not in here either. What are we gonna find at the top? That's where we're going, isn't it? Right up to the top. No, don't, don't put the kid crying sound. I don't want to hear the kid crying sound. That's what's gonna get me. I don't want to hear babies crying. Like I, I, I'm willing to deal with just about anything else, just not babies. You know, it's like that one game where there's nothing. Oh wait, here it is. There it is. There's her doll. Got it. Giant piles of belongings. Let's go bring it back to the girl. Alright. Here you go. I hope whatever whatever good. This is what I was afraid of, really. I'm afraid that it's gonna end very terribly. Is this our home? This isn't our home, is it? Where's Grandpa? Is this supposed to be our home? It doesn't look like the same home that I remember. I guess this is where he was camped out. See, this is the problem when you go looking for somebody in the middle of a war zone. There's no guarantee that they're going to be there when you get there. And then you could be in a much worse situation than you were before if you'd stayed away. Which is usually why these things are a bad idea. Oh, no. Yeah, I thought so. We gotta run, Bonnie! Yeah. You know, we all... We... Her grandfather was yeah. gone forever, and we were alone, underground, hiding away from the horrible noises above. What was going on up there? Though the odds were terrible, the people fought back. Even though some said it was hopeless and much too late. Their weapons were puny compared with their oppressors, but their spirits hadn't been totally crushed. They fought on, but there was no escape in the end. The last of the Red Folk were rounded up and taken away. We heard terrible noises as we squeezed through the sewers. I heard the full story much later. 
I also heard that there was truth in the old rumors we had heard of the people beyond the wall, people who could change your color. Interesting. Change your color. Not always that simple, is it, though? Not in the real world. Okay. Well, I got grim. Let's see how much grimmer it's gonna get. What is this? Oh. Okay. Well, that, that could have been bad. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Never mind, that was really bad. Run! All right, wait a minute. Run! Well, that doesn't help old Charles now, does it? There we go. Forgot how to shine the light brighter. Apparently, she can't go in the dark, so... Oh, that's convenient. There we go. Here we go, Charles. Thank you for the light. Now we can do this, and I don't know what this is. What, what do we got? Are uh, we playing Tetris? Is this some kind of puzzle game thing? Oh, it's one of those things. Okay. Who invents these things for the sewer? Does somebody just go, Oh, yes, this is a perfect invention for my sewer experiment. I'm just going to make sure that, you know, we're going to build the puzzles in order to have the sewer system work properly. We're going to do this hokey pokey puzzle thing with two people in order to make sure that the sewer system doors will open. Yeah, that seems sound. What was this done by? I feel like everything in this entire place was invented by the Home Alone kid. You know, gotta make it complicated, full of puzzles. Or the Riddler. Or I don't know, somebody who really, really liked making things much more complicated than they needed to be. Oh, hey, people. Hi, welcome to the sh Oh, what, what, what? Why are you guys thinking about the one, the same kid? The same kid? Hello, good sir. That looks like a very prominent lever. No, children, do not pull the lever. That is for adults only. And I don't know why we want in that room. Oh, we're talking to the resistance? No, the resistance is ignoring us children. What, who are you looking for? Some person. I'm gonna push this button. It's gonna open this thing. You guys don't mind, right? We're just gonna look outside at the, the, the destruction. I don't know what I'm looking for. I just know that it's bad. Not sure what that accomplished. What are you looking at me for? What? What? Hey kid, can you find this kid with the red hat? Downstairs is a nurse. Go ask her. Okay, well I don't know what you guys are talking about because all adults sound like wah 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 Where's this nurse? Nurse! Nurse! There's no nurse! Where's this nurse? I don't see any nurse. There is no nurse here. Sir, I'm looking for a nurse. Ah, oh, thank you. I'm going to go see the nurse. Nurse! You're important. We want a red cap thing. Oh, you want to turn us into the red cap? Or you want us to find the red cap lady? Uh, is, this, is this lady important? Oh, you're giving us... Okay, thank you. All right, well, you, you, you can go and fix that person and all that stuff. And we're just going to go find this girl that's missing that's apparently really important to our rebel cause. Hey, sir, we would like to leave. We've got the papers. Allow us to go and rescue all your sorry butts by finding the lady that you're all crying about. That's apparently really important. I don't know why she's important. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I didn't read the sign. I, I, I oh. Okay. All right, let's just use our brain here. We need to get to the X, right? So, da 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 I think we would go down, which should be fine. Oh, there we go. 
think this is the way. Oh, well, that's confusing. That way, and that way. That didn't work. Okay, so I gotta go this way. Up. What's up? Oh, this is real confusing. This is not what I bargained for. This way. There we go. I got it. I got it. This is the way. That is not the way. Okay, so it's the other one. Is this it? I think this is it. No, I went back in a full circle. Okay, we'll go back up. It's very confusing. Are we lost? Yeah, oh, give me an achievement for telling me that I'm lost. Yeah, maybe. Maybe just a little bit. This way. Down. Ah, oh, there we go. I see it. I think I see it. No, that's not right. I'm right back where I started. Okay, I gotta get to the this one. Here we go. I got I got it. I got it. I got it. Don't worry, I got it. This way. That way. No, it did work. It did work. It did work. I got it. Ah, there we go. I got it. I got it. Aha! Aha! See? It's just a matter of trial and error. Alright, where's this lady? Who's this? Why are you here? Why are you important? Hello, lady! No, oh, please sit down. Okay, we'll sit down. Would you like some fish? Yeah, fish would be great. We're very hungry. We found the little girl and she told us her tale. Okay. She used to live in the orphanage where Janusz was in charge and he had stayed right there with the kids as he had promised. When the robots came to take them away, he refused to leave their side. He held their hands as they all stood together. Then the robot guards led them all away. Even though the resistance could have saved Janusz, even though he could have escaped, he kept his promise. And he went along with the children into the flying train. It took off, and none of them were ever seen again. But this little girl, she was the only one who got away. And now, she was talking about a couple on the other side of the wall. Somehow she knew that if she could get to them, they would adopt her and perhaps change her color. Then she would be safe. Her eyes brimmed with hopeful tears as she said, Maybe they would adopt you too as well. Okay. And then there were three. What? You wanna you wanna get into the flying boat thing? Don't know how to work it? Don't worry. Charles and I Charles and Bonnie's got it. We'll we'll push this in. You get come? I need a name for the new girl. What we're we gonna call her? Susie! We're gonna call her Susie. There we go. Alright, Susie. It's Susie, Bonnie, and Charles now. It's a trio. We're 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 the, the children team. There we go. Charles, you're so good at driving. I don't know why you're always driving, but you're good at it. Uh-oh. Oh, 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 oh. See? So good at it, Charles. You're, you're pro, man. I'm glad this thing moves faster than, uh, than the motorbike does, because, yeah. I'm able to go back and forth and save our pretty butts. All right. What, what, what's happening? Bonnie? Susie? You see anything? Uh, looks like a pirate ship. Looks like a bunch of ships. Bunch of uh, very damaged ships. Where? Oh no! 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 Bonnie! No! 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 A oh, Stuzzy! <laughs> that was short lived. Are we not going back for her? We would go back for Bonnie. We go back for Charles, but we're, but Susie, we just met her. It don't matter. It don't matter. She just, you know, just just met the girl. Not, oh. Okay. Well, we got our own problems. What? What? We can fly now? All okay, right. We're doing this. Whoa! 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 whoa. Ow! No. Oh no! I right, got ah. <laughs> okay. My. Pea shooter of doom. Just hit the deck. Okay. Hop, 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 hop. I'm not very good at this. I don't know why I'm in charge of Bonnie and Charles, but I probably shouldn't be. Here we go. You ain't taking me down, you big giant piranha fish thing of doom. I am too good for that. I'm just gonna keep firing 
and assuming that I'm gonna be able to hit at some point. Whoop. Whoop. Oh no. This is way harder than it looks. Come on, Brown Boy! You got nothing on me! That's not working. I'm having some trouble with this. You got no, no. Ah, son of a beast wax. I think I'm making progress. Or maybe not. Ow. Whoa, whoa. I got it. I got it. Okay. Now that's open. I don't know. How do I? That didn't work. Oh, come on! Are you kidding me? This is way harder than it should be! I only got three lives! Fine! Bring it! Whoop, 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 whoop. Ow! There we go. Alright. There we go! Ha! See? See? Uh, but, uh, what? What is this? What? What? What is? What's is that? Is that death? It's got a plus sign. Normally, plus sign means life. I I don't know if that was life or death. Oh no, no! You gonna get harder? It was hard enough before. Fine, 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 fine. Perfectly fine. I just going to kick your butt. That's what I'm gonna do. Ah, uh, ha. This is kind of driving me nuts! Come in, come in, come in, come in, come in, come in. I don't got all day. Yep, 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 yep. Ow! Ah! I'm gonna concentrate. Concentrate on keeping myself alive. There we go. All right, so, what is this? It better not kill me. It better help me. Ah, that's what I thought. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, this one. There we go. Okay, heal me, heal me. I ain't dying no more. I, I'm done with dying. I'm, I'm happy to, to not die. I'm happy to live, but I, I, I'm i getting a little frustrated here. This is, this is getting a little tougher than I bargained for. Come on, you fish. I oh, ba, 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 ba. nope, 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 Wait, 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 no! Oh, shoot! Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Okay, oh no, 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 no! I want to do it again! Bye! <laughs> do it again! And again, and again, and again, and again, and again, and again, and whoop! Alright, bring me back my life! I am not riding this boat very well! There we go, one. Where's the next one? Two. And one more, please. Thank you. All right, come on, you big overgrown piranha. There we go. All right, we're fine. I see I didn't get hit that time. I I'm improving. Aha. It, 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 oh, yeah, see? Down you go, you giant can opener. <sighs> we're free. But we worked it. I want my happy ending. I worked hard for that. Give me a happy ending. I do not want to get out through all this and find out I got a bad ending. I want a happy ending. Look, happy ending. Why is everything, what, what, why, what's going on? You're willing to take the girl, but not Charles? Okay. Oh. She's not gonna leave Charles. Okay, so maybe maybe I do get my happy ending. I, I see, I see. Oh, Charles, you chivalrous man, you. Making sure Bonnie, Bonnie lives with a family. The couple were keen to make my friend part of their lives. But I was so glad for her. She would be safe at last in the world beyond the wall. But there was only room for one child. One child. So it was time for the two of us to part. We had come through so much together.
She took out the photograph of the two of us, the one that had been taken on the last day before the invasion. She tore it in two, so we'd both have half to remind us of each other. Then she went away, and I never saw her again. After that, I had many more adventures, of course, but that is all a story for another time, perhaps. And maybe one day, I told the girl in my bookstore, you will hear it, my dear. She was looking at me thunderstruck. I've heard that story before, she said, about the girl and the boy and the photograph mm. from my grandma. <laughs> Downstairs, uh. the shop doorbell rang. Okay. It's, uh, it's not bad. It is not bad. I, is, I am so glad. Charles, you chivalrous man, you. After how many years? Years and years? I figured this is how it would have been. I mean, she did bear a resemblance to uh, the girl in the photograph, so it would make sense. I just, I kind of forgot after all this time. He's painted red and she isn't. Because he. Let's see. <laughs> okay! So we get to push. Okay, wait, wait. I just I just want to have a quick look. Okay, we're, we're not going to leave. Okay. I, I just wanted to have a quick look. We're going to push them together. Come on! Push her too? Oh, yes. Yes, we do. <laughs> oh, that's nice. That's that's nice. That's nice. Is that how it ends? Is that, is that it? There was some no. kind of magic at work, perhaps. Magic that brought her grandmother to my door that very night. We went downstairs, and I saw her waiting. At first, I froze. The girl pushed me closer, and then I recognized my friend. We hugged, and all that time simply dropped away. After all the adventures and the changes that everyone must face, we were the same two kids all over again. That's what I mean when I say life can still surprise us on even very ordinary days. And now my story is done. I dedicate it to anyone who's been forced to part from their loved ones and who has survived long enough to see them again. Well, that is good. I, uh, I'm very, very happy that it actually didn't end the way that I was at worst feared. I kind of should have seen it coming, actually. It makes sense, because the daughter, the girl at the beginning looked a lot like, and I, I kind of thought at the time, but when you go through the whole game, and you go through the story, you tend to forget little details like that. Ah, uh, well that's my memory of us. This was a very, I like this game a lot. It's a very nice story. It's very, very interesting. And I know it bears a lot of similarities to some of our history, but I hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I did. Um, I think that's everything that this game has, though. And there's not much beyond it. Just some memory stuff. This was really good. I hope you enjoyed this as much as I did. I suppose this is the end of this series though 
And uh, for what it's worth, thank you for watching the whole thing with me. I will see you in the next one. So until then, you know it. <laughs>